From the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good afternoon, Central Pennsylvania. I'm meteorologist Jacob Morris here with your CNET forecast. We're expecting another period of rain to impact our region throughout the overnight hours tonight. Now we'll allow temperatures to drop throughout the day on Friday, setting up for a colder but dry weekend across our region. Current live look across Beaver Stadium this afternoon shows those overcast skies. Still some fog across our area. That's because temperatures right now are at 45 degrees and the dew point is also at 45 degrees. With that fog, the visibility is down to around one mile, so leave a little extra time for yourself if you're heading out on the roadways this afternoon or this evening. Temperatures across the Commonwealth, mainly in the middle to uh, lower 40s in the eastern half of the state. 54 degrees, a little bit warmer though in Scranton, and 50 degrees down in Harrisburg. They're in the middle to upper 50s though in the western half of the state with some southerly flow across those regions. As we zoom out to the entirety of the country, much colder air across the uh, central part of the country, and this will be moving into our area as we head into the weekend. Current radar and satellite shows those clouds thickening west to east across the state and the precipitation is knocking on the door, currently impacting the southwestern part of the state and they'll be moving into the center county area over the next several hours. This is associated with this low pressure system that will be moving through our area throughout the next 24 hours and behind that, as I showed you in the last graphic, a lot colder air will be filtering into our region. Let's time this out with future weather. First, starting off at around 6 o'clock this evening, that's when we can start to see some of those showers impacting our area, and that will continue throughout the evening hours tonight. So if you have any evening plans, make sure you grab that umbrella or put on that rain jacket. Those showers will continue throughout the early morning hours on Friday and then exiting the state by the time that you're waking up on Friday morning. Temperatures by the early morning hours on Friday will be around 46 to even around 50 degrees across central Pennsylvania, but then they, they plummet throughout the early morning hours and throughout the rest of the day on Friday. Feels like temperatures around 30 degrees by 8 a.m. on Friday morning, and then those temperatures continue to decrease throughout the day. 22 degrees for your feels like temperatures by around lunchtime tomorrow, and then approaching the single digits by the evening hours on Friday. And those feels like temperatures will continue to be very low throughout the day on Saturday. So break out those winter jackets once again because winter is back across our region. Your forecast for the night tonight, 50 degrees with periods of rain and those mild temperatures. And then tomorrow, temperature at around 36 degrees throughout the morning hours. And that will continue to decrease to uh, below freezing by the late afternoon and early evening hours with winds gusting to 30 to 35 miles per hour out of the west. Your seven-day forecast from CNET shows mostly sunny skies for the day on Saturday. Those windy conditions continuing, however, with a high temperature only at around 28 degrees for Saturday. Lows on Friday and Saturday night will be in the teens and then a little bit warmer for the day on Sunday. Mixture of clouds and sunshine with a high of at around 36 degrees. Some snow could impact our area in the overnight hours Sunday into Monday. Temperature on Monday at around 35 degrees and then on a larger system we're watching for the day on Tuesday, possibly as snow and then transitioning to a period of mixed precipitation with temperatures around average as we head into next week. For CNET, I'm meteorologist Jacob Morris. Have yourselves a great evening.